Bonjour mes amis, my name is Freya and welcome to day 13 of the Creatures Community Spirit Festival. Festival ends tomorrow, and you know what that means. It means I get to sleep. But that is in the future. For now, let's talk about yesterday's releases. Yesterday we had Mia's Silversmith Wolfling Run adoptions, as well as... Okay, get ready for this, the tiny head thing got even better. This is Depressed Auto Electrician, and she's one of Mia's micro-headed grundles. Up next, we have a breed concept that I came up with some years ago, but never tried to make a visual for. These are what I've decided to call the Red Velvet Creatures, but really, I'm just a sucker for desserts. <laughs> also, we have this incredible artwork from Linda of my Banshee cosplay, which I adore, and I'm so pleased with this. And I'm also super in love with the way she draws Grendels. Like, I'm definitely gonna have to figure out how to draw them at some point, so I'll probably be looking to Linda for advice. <laughs> okay. Before I get to today's releases, here's the meme of the day from Spaceship Rat, because once you have a Norn model, you, you need to make memes with it. And today we received Mia's Spinal Wolfing Run adoptions and her random export collection. One of the creatures called herself Pomegranate Mustard, despite being named Helix True, and I thought that was interesting, and I also can't stop thinking about mustard on pomegranates. I'm also going to be releasing Miss Megnan Buffbody Esquire, who died in yesterday's Wolfling Run video. She will be greatly missed. Here's a eulogy prepared by Bone, the person who submitted her to the run. Today we say goodbye to Miss Megnan Buffbody Esquire. She will long be remembered to all as a businesswoman, an elevator enthusiast, and quite frankly a legend. But to those of us who had the privilege of knowing her personally, of knowing who she truly was. She was a beautiful soul, taken from us far too soon. I remember when I thought her into existence, and the careful planning and forethought that went into her creation. I remember when we met for the first time and she told me I had funny-looking ears. I remember the time we spent as roommates, and, in a way, teammates. It was us against the world, and us against the Homeowners Association. I, and many others, ache with the passing of such a dear friend. I know if she were here with me today, she'd tell me not to be sad for her passing, but rather to be eem eximly bibble. So, on this day, we remember and grieve, but we also celebrate the life and legacy of Miss Megnan Buffbody Esquire. I also release the children from the last episode, the Parallel Twins, Cold Muscle and Lowly Cloth, and the Parallel Children, Rich Uncle and Depressed Care, as well as Harmonious Brass, Born to Flynn and Raiden Britannica. When scoring, I'm only going to count Parallel Children as one, since they only occurred once per timeline. And finally, we have Kitty Takara's Forbidden Fruit, which does not disappear once eaten, and can teach creatures their vocabulary. That's gonna do it for today's video, so thank you everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed, let me know in the comments below, and I'll catch you guys in the finale tomorrow. Bye!